welcome or welcome back to Penny's Two Cents. It's your girl Penny, and today I have my father with me. Hi, everyone. Guys, we're at Five Guys. So, we did a review not too long ago of uh, what was it? Um, sheets, sheets, uh, hot dogs. Dad made everybody hungry for sheets, hot dogs. So, I told Dad, Are you in a mood for a hot dog again? Because I am hungry for a hot dog, and we're going to review a hot dog that we have never reviewed before. <laughs> so, we decided on five guys we've never had five guys hot dogs guys okay guys <laughs> this quite possibly is the most i've ever spent on a hot dog i don't even know if i've spent as much at amusement park for a hot dog guys no. they look like little dinky hot dogs okay guys i thought they were going to be bigger um dad got just a regular hot dog with mustard and onion six dollars and 99 cents i got a cheese dog with mayo, mustard, onion, and jalapeno peppers for $7.89. Gee. This quite possibly is the most I've ever spent for a hot dog. Most of that. I know it's the most you've ever spent for <laughs> I know it's the most dad's most ever. Most I've ever eaten for a hot dog. Most spent for a hot dog. Okay, so the bun's kind of split open. It, it is, it's it's a hot dog that's split open and grilled on the grill. They got some onions in here today, but I am going to put okay. just a little more mustard on here. I brought, okay. I brought mustard from home, guys. Oh, <laughs> I threw the mustard <laughs> I threw the mustard ball and slammed into the side of my door. Thank God it didn't hit the window. So I go, this is probably going to be pretty messy too, Dad, because the bun is like split. Yeah. But I'm putting some extra mustard on here for you because I know that you need it. And I'm just going to give this thing to Dad and let him go to it. Dad, you want me to kind of like, can you work around this aluminum foil or no? No, I'm going to try. Okay. Try. Okay, because I'm afraid if I take it totally out, I'll just try not to eat the aluminum foil. So okay. that's the end of the hot dog right there. So if you're new to the channel, guys, Dad has macular degeneration. It's a progressive vision loss. So I help him with his things. He can see light and he can see dark, but he can't make out detail. His field of vision is like a really foggy curtain, okay? So I touch his things. I handle his things. I'm sanitized. Um, so I don't want anybody coming for me or dad, but mustard and onions he's got on his. Let's, let's talk about mine. I got a cheese dog. So mine's a dollar more than dad's for the cheese, guys. For the cheese. Let's check it out here. So like I said, it's a split hot dog. They like, um, this foil down. They split it and grill it. So there's cheese on there. I got some jalapeno. It looks like fresh jalapeno rings. Yes, it's not pickled, it's fresh. I got a little row of mustard there. I see mayo poking out in the back here. So this is what you're getting at Five Guys. And I got my, I got raw onion as well on mine. This is what you're getting it for Five Guys for a hot dog, but I'm craving a hot dog, so let's see. Dad made everybody hungry for hot dogs. I had so many comments, Dad, um, on our um, sheets, on our sheets review when yeah. you had the hot dogs. I had so many comments saying that that you made them hungry for hot dogs, so they had to, <laughs> they had to go get a hot dog, and I agree. He made me hungry for a hot dog, too, and I don't even like hot dogs like that, so let's see if Five Guys can impress me. Their prices aren't impressing me, I'll tell you that right now. Okay, I'm shutting up. Okay, I can see Dad's having a little bit of an issue. He has dentures, right? The hot dog is more like a sausage hot dog or like a um, beef hot dog. Not so, not, not like sausage flavored, you know what I mean? But like a really good beef hot dog with the casing on it. So I saw that he was having a little trouble biting through it. But I like that about it. I like, I don't like mushy hot dogs, okay? I like hot dogs that have, I call it that snap. The hot dog snap. When you bite into the skin and there's a snap in the skin and the hot dog does, isn't mushy itself. It's got a good chew to it. That's the hot dogs I prefer. Okay. 
I like the taste of this thing. Okay, the cheese on it is just like um, American cheese, sliced American cheese. These jalapenos got some spice to them because they're real jalapenos. I like the mayo and mustard combination that I put on here. I could have used a few more onions, but I don't know how they would have stayed on here. But Okay. I'm going to say this right now. Yes, the prices are crazy, guys. Don't come for me. I don't make these prices up, okay? But as of now, I would, you know, I would say have hot dogs at home, right? You can get your own hot dogs, your own special brand that you guys like, put everything on it. Yeah, I understand that. But if I was going to order a hot dog... And I haven't had hot, many hot dogs out, okay? But if I was just going to order kind of like, not like a Coney dog, because I have a special place for Coney dogs. And I'll have to, we'll have to do a review on them. It's a it's a, a mom and pop place. But we haven't done a review on that yet. But if I just want like more of a traditional hot dog like this, I would come here again. But these prices, these prices are crazy. Because I think this tastes really good. Do you think it tastes good, Dad? The onion is not, not too prevalent in there. Yeah, they did put a lot of onion. They put, there's a sprinkle of them on. Yeah, sure. Foil. I like the taste of this, guys. Um, Okay, so Five Guys, they have like A1 sauce, they have ketchup, mustard, of course, mayo, they have cheese, they have the jalapenos, they have bacon. Um, you can even add a hamburger patty to this. I can't imagine that on there. I don't know if they cut it in half and stick it on there. I don't know. I feel like they would need a little bit bigger of a bun. I wish the hot dog was just a little bit bigger, like one of those quarter pound hot dogs. And paying that price, maybe it would have been a little bit more like feasible to spend that money. But I like the flavor of this hot dog. I like the snap of the skin. I like the flavor. And you could customize it any way you want. Like I said, they got A1 sauce, they got hot sauce, they got pickles, tomatoes, lettuce, anything out, in a, you know, like a hamburger would um, offer. Grilled onions, grilled mushrooms you can put on it. <clears throat> Guys, if you've had a Five Guys uh, hot dog, please comment below on how you like, you know, what toppings you like on it. What do you think makes it taste like the like the thing, you know, the best ever? Um, tell me, have you had Five Guys and do you like the Five Guys hot dogs? Um, I didn't even know they had hot dogs for the longest time until somebody said, have you ever tried a Five Guys hot dog? And I was like, I've never tried a Five Guys hot dog. So that's why we're doing it today. I'm getting a little bit full, so I was going to take another bite, but I'm getting a little bit full. Um, I'm going to ask Dad. He's finishing up. I'm not hurrying him in any way. I just want to ask you to think about your score for that. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to explain our rating scale, guys. A five or lower is that thing is garbage. Don't waste your money. Get something else. A six to a seven is it's, eh, we'd eat it, but we really wouldn't recommend it. Anything above a seven, we recommend. The closer it gets to a 10, we highly recommend. And guys, we rarely give out 10s. We only give out 10s, a special something that knocks our socks off. That thing that tastes so good, you can't imagine it tasting any better. That's what we, we give out 10s to. Okay, and like I said, not everything out here is a 10. You can't, it, I, we want to be honest with you. Our goal is to save you money. So we're going to tell you our honest opinions. And we're not sugarcoating it. We're not sponsored in any way. So, <clears throat> that's that. And if you, if you haven't already, guys, please show the subscribe button some love. It's down below. Click it, boop it, smash it. It's free. It's easy. 
And if you've already subscribed, or if you don't want to subscribe, we understand. But can you give us a thumbs up on this video? That's the easiest way you can support us in our videos, is take that few extra seconds, hit the thumbs up. It helps push our videos out. Some Possibly more people will see them and, you know, more subscribers and more great Penny Pinchers crew that we already have. Guys, I want to thank you. Thank you for the great respectful comments. Thank you for, you know, the respectful questions and, you know, uh, telling me how, yeah, how you felt about, you know, whatever, we, if you've tried something that we reviewed or whatever. Thank you for all that. That helps as well. That shows support. It also helps in the YouTube universe push out our videos when you comment. Even if you say hi, have a good day, whatever. I think that helps out as well. Um, I was going to say something else, but... I guess that's it for now. Like I said, um, I am not excited about these prices. So if I was going to score this on the prices, I would say don't waste your money. Okay? I would say make your hot dogs at home. But say that you don't want to make your hot dogs at home. Or say you're out shopping. Or say you're dr out driving and you're like, oh, I want a hot dog right now. I do like the flavor of this hot dog. So I am going to recommend it for that. If you want a quick hot dog... You know, you want it to be like a good beef hot dog. It has a good flavor, and you can put what you pretty much what you want on it. I recommend it for that, okay? Is there anything you'd like to say about it, Dad, or? I'd rather have sheets. <laughs> you'd rather have a sheets hot dog? Uh -huh. For 99 cents? Uh, exactly. <laughs> okay. Taste and everything. The taste and everything, you think? Onion. Onion. Is non-existent as far as I'm well, concerned. Well, yeah. There is very few onion chunks on here. So I guess if I was in there, maybe if I ordered... Because I ordered it on the app, right, guys? So if I was in there next time I was ordering it, I would probably tell them, you know, go heavy on the onion if you can. Because I do like the onion flavor. I understand where Dad's coming from. They only put a few little sprinkles of onion on there so I understand that. So the you meat, definitely okay. the meat is good. Okay. The, the meat the is hot good. Dog's good, yeah. The bun is a little soggy but uh it chewy at the end. Okay. Uh it was very good. It was a good uh, a good bun. It was a good uh, sausage. It's just, you just don't think it's worth that, that price and at all. The price is way out of whack. It is. No, way out of family whack. I think the price is way out of whack, too. You want a drink of your soda? Yeah. While you're getting a drink of this, I want to ask you to think about your score. So, yeah, I'm going to add to this. So, the bun was okay for me. I love the flavor of the sausage. Like Dad said, yeah, I would ask for extra. If I went in there, it's hard on, on these apps. Sometimes you don't get the offer, you know, the chance to say extra onion or whatever. If I went in there and ordered it, I would definitely ask for extra onion if that's what you're at wanting because they just put a tiny little sprinkle. But I think the, the, the hot dog itself is a good quality hot dog. I like that they split it and put it on the grill and kind of give it that grill flavor or whatever. I really like this one. I recommend that this one... Um, as far as a hot dog, but man, the price is the price. So it's hard for me to score this, but I'm scoring it on the taste. Okay, guys, I'm not, I'm trying not to work in the, the, the price of it. The price of it, yeah, it's not worth it. Okay, I understand that. But it's like everywhere, everywhere else. These prices aren't, half the prices that we spend on these things ain't worth what we ate. You know what I mean? So I, 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 I'm factoring out the price. So what score would you give this hot dog, Dad? It's seven. Seven, okay. So the lowest I've been uh, on a hot dog, and that's the the good the good part is, is the hot dog. Yeah. At and least it is a quality it. hot dog itself. The meat, they like Dad said, they spread it. They yeah. spread it, and they, they warmed it, and that's that's good. But like uh, you said, you just rather have sheets, huh? I'd rather have sheets. You'd rather overall. have two of the smaller hot dogs for have... 99 cents a piece than this bigger, a little bit bigger one for high dollar. All right. Okay. Okay. I, I, have, I haven't had sheets hot dogs, guys. I'll have to try one. I just know that that hot dog isn't as quality. I think this, this hot dog itself, the meat itself, is more quality than the sheets hot dog. Okay. Uh, they, uh... But 
I, I don't know, so I can't explain. I can't say that I don't like sheets. I, I haven't said that, but I'm gonna tell you what I think about this hot dog. I like having my jalapeno on it. I like having the cheese on it. I like the combination I got, and I think this hot dog, the taste of it, is a good hot dog, a good quality hot dog. And I'm not factoring in the the score. So for me, this hot dog, this hot dog's a nine. This hot dog's a nine in flavor for me because it's got that good hot dog, the good snap. But to be honest, guys, if I was scoring it by taste and what I spent, I'd be like that. I'd be like seven, seven and a half, you know, because the price is, is crazy. But I mean, I'm, we're going on taste here. So I have to, I have to give it a nine. I mean, that's it. I think it's a good hot dog. <laughs> Dad rather have sheets. No, anytime, anytime. <laughs> so we spent what we spent. Shoo, we spent seven. We spent fifteen dollars. I tell you what, you dogs. could have bought if you could have bought these hot dogs at the same price as, as another place by yourself and you, fix them by yourself. Oh yeah, at home. Yeah, we could have bought two packs in. of hot dogs and some onions. <laughs> Fix it at home, and <laughs> it'll be better for you. I went to Five Guys when we went in. I went in Five Guys. I had to get a little tub of these salted, oh, these salted nuts, guys. I have to every time. Might as well. You done spent fifteen dollars on two hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I just stuck my finger in my thumb and Dad's mustard. Anyway, guys, let us know. Have you had the hot dogs at Five Guys? Do you like them? If so. What do you put on your Five Guys hot dogs that makes it, like, the greatest? Because I know people are like, I put this and this and this and this is the best thing ever. You know, let me know. I would I would probably try it sometime. Um, sometime when Dad's doing, like, the cheeseburger or whatever. I would do the hot dog with different toppings on it. But are you about ready to go home? I would. I would. Ready to let these guys I eat, go? I eat all the hot dogs. Yeah. And I uh, uh, complain. But it was a good hot dog. Yeah. It was a good You complained hot dog. about the price and it's just not It was it was not oriented towards your family. Like oh yeah, you ain't gonna buy the a bunch price of these. Is not yeah. You're not gonna you. yeah, you're not gonna put two of your kids in the car, you and your wife or husband or whatever in a car and buy them all hot dogs. Because you know, you'd be boy, broke. A boy's a, a boy you want can two eat hot two, dogs, two or three. Two easily. Uh, easy. All right, no two way. easy. Seven dollars for a hot dog. If you ate two, that's fourteen. Ate three, that'd be twenty-one dollars for three hot dogs. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Let's not think about the price. So, guys, we hope you all have a great lunch, a great dinner, or a great late-night snack. But most of all, guys, we hope you have a great day. A great day and a better tomorrow. And God bless. Yes, guys. God bless. Come back tomorrow. See what we're eating. See what we're reviewing. See if we like it or not. Until tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.